Thai as a concept was born when a handful of Silicon Valley entrepreneurs with roots in the Indian subcontinent met by chance in 1992, and out of that meeting came the idea of an organization that would bring together high achievers from that region for the purpose of networking. Uh, Geeta Ramamurthy, uh, tell me about uh, how this, this, this group coming together um, and, and what that led to. These three gentlemen uh, who were waiting to receive somebody from, um, from uh, overseas um, just uh, didn't know each other at all. And uh, they introduced themselves and uh, they said, um, uh, you know, there is something common amongst all of us is entrepreneurship. And they said, wouldn't be a good idea if we had a forum where entrepreneurs like us can come together, exchange ideas, learn from each other's real life experience, and also offer support to each other. And that's how the idea was born. Mm -hmm. And uh, it, it got started in Silicon Valley. And today we have 15 chapters in 15 countries. And again, it's, uh, it's, it's mentoring and it's networking, and you, it's about uh, networking, connections, people meeting, meeting yes. other people, learning from each other? Yes, Thai is all about connections. And when people do come to our organization and they want to meet certain people, and uh, we facilitate these connections. And for, that is for, for, for example, give me a for instance. For example, uh, there was a gentleman who came, uh, sent an email to me uh, a couple of weeks ago, and he said that he needs to meet someone who is attending this conference that Al Kapoor uh, chaired. And uh, so I made it a point to uh, connect him with that other person that he wanted to meet. Mm -hmm. And uh, they met at TyCon. Uh, and uh, they exchanged their ideas, and they uh, wrote back to me saying that thank you for making this happen. You must have uh, you must have seen over the years uh, uh, lots of people businesses grow just from these connections. Is that uh, have you seen uh, cases of that people coming together and that happens all the time. All the time. Yes. All the time, and I think Venkat does one of those stories, and he was describing his story. Um, it's because it, it, it lets people know it develop their convictions and also. Mm -hmm shows them how what it takes to be successful. I think a, a lot of people, uh, most of us at one point in our lives probably think, gosh, I'd really love to start a business, but I, I just don't know how to take that first step or, or what should I do. Uh, what, what, do you, what, does the, um, what does Ty Boston do to help individuals who may have an idea in their head but can't figure out a way to, uh, to, to get it from their head to you know, an actual business? Building enterprises is like a science. It's, it's very much, it's not an exact science, but it, it's, there are elements to it that could be understood. So anyone who has an idea has to first, uh, you know, uh, understand the, the, all the elements of their idea itself in terms of what the product is, what its features are, uh, who's going to use those products. And then not only that, but they would need a team. Uh, they'll have to set up systems and processes in their company. They'll have to also uh, raise capital. And, and make a lot of decisions uh, that would be uh, oriented uh, towards money. So uh, Thai Boston helps people with trying to fully uh, develop their idea. Mm -hmm. Now, Venkat, uh, tell, me, tell me about your business. Um, you know, how, how, what kind of business it is and how you were able to start it with the help of Thai Boston. Um, we are in this business of um, generating revenue for online bloggers. And essentially, we are a niche online advertising network focusing specifically in the blogosphere. So we started this, uh, this idea came to us in 2003, saying, and I was uh, spending time at Lycos, uh, working at a corporate level uh, online ad targeting technologies, and we thought, we can take this idea to small, medium publishers. Idea is great. We had a fantastic um, blueprint of a concept, but where do we start? Starting a company is uh, almost like kickstarting 100 different engines at the same time. That was the time I leaned on Thai, and I said, there are people out there who have done that before. And then just talk to them and tell them this is the idea. And I got fantastic advice from them, saying that, take the first step, get the, get the demo up and running. And then this is what worked for us. This is what didn't work for us. This is what I call as the stage where you have to cross the chasm. And you're sitting there at a full-time job with a brilliant idea, taking, taking it to the, to the market. And you have this butterfly in your stomach saying, I'm a somebody here, but when I go out, it's I'm a stranger among strangers. What do I do? Organizations like Thai will give us a fantastic platform where we are not a stranger among strangers. We are among people who share the same passion, and uh, they're, they're out there guiding you, saying, we've been there, we've been through that too. 
and let's go forward. I, I view this as a safety net, a virtual safety net that is very, very important for an entrepreneur who's sitting there saying, I'm going to go for it, and I'm going to do it. And that's exactly how Thai helped me out. And it continues to help me at all stages. Mm -hmm. uh, Gita, what, what, what are some of the things that, uh, I guess, the questions, the problems, the, the, the issues that all these new entrepreneurs, when they first come to Thai, what, what kinds of questions do they have? What are they usually looking for? They're basically looking for advice as to, you know, we have an idea. We have no clue as to what to do next. And, you know, who do we meet? How do we get help? And uh, they're also looking for investment. And it doesn't start with investment. It also starts with, uh, you know, get culling the idea and uh, the supporting material together, putting, putting certain ideas around it together, and meet the investors. You say it's, uh, it's not just about the investment, but it's about uh, uh, helping them understand their, yes. their market and what they're trying to do? Yeah. Okay. And we bring uh, them uh, to speak to the right-minded people who have been there and done it. And that's the unique uh, f facilitating that we do in time. Okay. Very successful. Okay, we're going to take